Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I realized that it's been some time since I started my video from home, so get ready with me for casting. And I don't know if anyone knows, but it's my channel one year anniversary. And if you follow my Instagram, you know that I asked you to ask me questions because I was planning to make Q&A for my anniversary video, but I decided that I'm gonna make Q&A a little bit later, like winter time, when it's too cold to go outside, but for now, the weather is so nice, so I just don't want to spend my time filming Q&A at home and I need to do more vlogging, so that's what we're gonna do today and yeah, I'm sorry, Q&A will wait a little bit because I experiment a lot with my makeups lately I just can't stop if I start doing makeup, I just keep going I'm like, oh, I'm gonna draw a little small wing on my eye and then my wing is like one meter long so I need to be really careful today because it's casting so I can't do too much makeup and a small hack for my young models out there which I use myself every time and it actually helps is that before going to casting I usually check their website or insta and I look how they did the makeup for the models before and I try to copy it because their style usually similar from shooting to shooting and it's better if I already look how they want me to look on the shooting. Same thing about clothing, if you have a chance to dress up for the brand style, then also it can help. For today's casting, I checked that their models almost have no makeup. I mean, obviously I can see what kind of makeup they have. For example, their shadows make their eyes like deeper. And because I do makeup, luckily I can use this hack because I can analyze what they put on their faces and I can just follow the steps. So yeah, for this brand, I need to do super light, like almost invisible. So my makeup is different for like each casting and I know that not every time you need to go with like no makeup makeup because some clients I check their websites and their models have like pretty strong makeup so that's what I do again for the castings fluffy natural eyebrows touched only by nature I feel like my face is just blank paper with this makeup because I used to do something stronger lately it's not like I feel uncomfortable it's just I already forgot how my face looks like with this little makeup. I even use brown mascara because my lashes are long and I have volume. So if I use black mascara, it's too dark. And I can't do that because we're natural, right? Natural, bare face, no makeup, no filter, just as it is. Now, I'm sorry, but it doesn't matter how light my makeup is, my lips cannot be light. I'm dark winter, so if my lipstick is too light, I just look like silicone doll, so the shade is like nude on me. See? Even this is too light, you know? I can go darker. If you watched my late videos, I usually go for something like plum or cranberry. This lipstick is one of my favorites lately. I love it. It's super easy to use, to carry, and it's just super pretty, but it's red. So yeah, today we're going with something more natural, but I think I need to add a little bit color, like what is that? Or do I need to stop right now? <laughs> I mean, it, it looks good, but yeah, because I want something darker. Doesn't matter what you want. You need to look natural, bare face, yeah. Uh, just a little bit, just a little bit of color, okay? No, fine. I'll stop right now. Life hack, use like light liner for the 
bottom lashes so it just creates the shade and eyes just pop a little more and it looks super natural like it's my natural shade mine is like this it's called rosy nude super light like beige i'll style my hair a little bit not like style but i need to straighten it up like here yeah just a little and i already need to leave so i'm gonna do it quick I also wanted to tell you that I actually like this brush from Dyson better than this one and I use it on daily basis like this is more if I want to go out and I want like a lot of volume and this like baby hair but this one is just for daily usage it helps my hair dry super quick and it just gives me like volume I want plus it's not straight so my hair don't look like this and at the same time it's not too much hair if you know what I mean so yeah I just use this one every time I wash my hair it's amazing me on the way me on the way to my not fun one hour subway ride I'm still waiting for my face to deep off because I woke up early today and my face was swollen and it is still it got better but it's still swollen and my nose is huge and my eyelids as well and my eyes keep watering and it's annoying like i know it's watering for a good reason because it's watering so i mean like a few minutes hours it's not gonna be swollen anymore but it's annoying me because it keeps ruining my makeup i need to keep fixing it <sighs> but yeah by the time i'll get to casting i think my face will look fine I just realized that when I woke up it was cloudy and I was a little bit upset about it because when it's cloudy the picture looks ugly, I mean on the camera, but it's sunny now. A lot of models in here so I need to wait. My eyes look so red because I slept bad today. Not like I slept well, but I slept little, like five hours because I was fighting mosquitoes all night. I couldn't fall asleep because I had a concert and I'm not a fan, but mosquitoes decided that I am a fan and they gave me private concerts, so I couldn't fall asleep for two hours and I went to sleep only at 2 a.m. And my eyes are red because I'm sleepy. I'm pretty far away from my house and I want to stay in this area today. How a train can go one way and then all of a sudden turns around and go back. Of course they said about it on the speaker. Of course they said about it in Korean. And I wasn't even the only one who stayed in the train so I couldn't be suspicious about it. Uh, well, yeah, anyways, my way was supposed to take 15 minutes. Instead, it took like 40 minutes. Only one station left before my station. And it just turned back. And so I went back one station. And I had to switch. I switched. And it happened to be express. And because it was express, I passed two stations after my station. So I had to take another line <laughs> and go all the way here. Oh my god. I told you that I want to stay in this area and I am still in this area. And that's why I was supposed to take 15 minutes only because I wanted to come to this park. And yeah, instead it took 40 minutes. Good that I wasn't late for anything. Weather is so nice and it's so pretty here. Look at all these trees and these buildings. Yeah. These buildings. So many people walking. It's what time is it? It's lunchtime right now, so many people came to the park. 
for a coffee break and just enjoy the weather. So am I. There is a shopping mall nearby my house and they already put Christmas tree in there. It's not even November. Why is there a Christmas tree? Like Halloween only tomorrow. Usually they start doing all this Christmas stuff after Halloween is over, like a few days after. And I can understand that. But did you see the weather? It's 18 degrees outside and look at all these trees. It's like bright, amazing, beautiful fall. And they already put Christmas tree. Many people in a coffee shop. Then I get it because it's lunchtime. And while I was waiting for my drink, I just got curious how many cups per day they're using. I got my drink and now I'm back in the park because everyone was walking with a drink and I got influenced. I had to get my drink as well. Look at the view. They also already prepared Christmas exhibition. It smells like pine in here. I'm not ready for Christmas yet. I didn't enjoy fall enough. Unpacking. Not like I have a lot to unpack, I just bought new lipstick. It's called Kiss Proof. No, it's called Locked Kiss 24 hours lipstick. And it's on my lips right now. They turned on Christmas music here outside. Showing you the color and the light. Once again, this lipstick looked super dark when I applied it on my wrist and then on my lips, it's this light. I mean, I tried it on, on my lips and I just liked it, but I like darker shades. This one is just, again, like nude for me natural daily lips i can't chuck it for the kiss proof part unfortunately but we'll see i'm not gonna reapply it and we'll see how long it will last in my lips i'm gonna drink with it i'm gonna eat with it and yeah we'll see how is it 24 hours
while my food is cooking. Let's make a drink. It's actually going to be my first time trying tteokbokki from the store because usually I just order it from like the pocky place but yeah from the pack it's my first time and we're gonna try it together and I feel like it's not cooked yet because it's pretty hard It's actually really good. It's spicy. I usually eat non spicy tteokbokki. Koreans would hit me for that because Koreans say that tteokbokki has to be spicy, but I can't eat too spicy. And I found a place where they can regulate the spiciness, so I usually take non spicy ones. These are pretty spicy, but it's, you know, good spicy. There are like different types of spicy. One is when it's burning everything inside and you can't even eat anything else and you can't taste any other food, you know, this... I don't like that type of spicy, but this type of spicy is just... I don't know, really nice. I like it. It's my first meal for today and I decided that it's gonna be a crime if I don't eat outside because do you see this? Like do you see this? Yeah, so I had to eat outside today and that was my pick. It's half past four and I don't know how to call this meal. It's not lunch, it's not dinner. Liner. Like brunch but liner. There is also supper. Lopper. Do you even know the difference between dinner and supper? I heard that supper is supposed to be later than dinner But I'm not sure, I never checked Let's check together because I'm really curious What's the difference between dinner and supper? It says that supper is an informal meal And dinner is more like formal And also in British English they say that Supper is like light meal or snack And dinner is main meal gotta be full after dinner but time wise it's the same thing like late afternoon no here it says that supper the main meal of the day and served in the late afternoon and dinner is served around noon okay so no right definition supper dinner if someone knows what's the difference between supper and dinner from native speakers please let me know but I don't know. Uh, so half past four means I'm eating early dinner, late lunch, dinner, lopper, supper, whatever. I'm just eating. I'm done eating. First is lipstick crush test. Didn't pass. I mean, I ate really spicy food and I licked my lips a lot and I drink a lot but it says kiss proof and 24 hours and definitely while people kissing they're licking lips so I'll try it later one more time I mean I didn't buy it so it stays all day I just bought it because I like the color but I wanna check one more time. They tell me 24 hours kiss proof. I'm gonna check it again. And now, if I had no dessert, means I had no meal. So we need to get dessert. But I don't wanna stay in this area anymore because first of all, sun already went down, if you can see. And it's getting cold a little bit. So I wanna go back to my area and 
I already found the coffee shop I want to go to, so let's go. We're taking a bike. Of course, I'm using my phone because I don't want to risk my camera. And you know what's funny? That bike ride will take less time than if I would go by subway. Subway would take like one hour and bike will take 50 minutes and something in my eye. And I just ate and I'm planning on eating dessert. So I really think that taking a bike is a wise decision and to enjoy this weather more. I just burned. You already done? Can you take care of your food? It looks so pretty. Strawberry roll and tea. There is some different tastes in the tea. It's uh, strawberry again and almond and something else. I don't remember, but it smells really good. Tastes like strawberry. Tea is like sweet and sour. It's not cake, it's purple. I was going to say that I like that this cake is not super sweet and then I tried the strawberry and strawberry is more sweet than cake itself like it's a good thing it's not a bad thing I mean it's just so good the berry is so sweet and also good I want more strawberries I'm tired but I'm happy because first of all I'm full Second, I had really good time today I enjoyed the weather, I enjoyed parks and riding a bike and my food and now I'm on the way home because it's time to rest Thank you guys for being with me, thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed my video